Now, if you're curious about the audio quality and the call quality, and let's face it, also the fit of this brand new Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro, well, you're gonna wanna watch this video because today we're gonna cover EBQ Man style call quality and audio tests, and we're gonna go over all of the features. Let's get right to it. Now, the Samsung Galaxy Buds line is a pretty mature line, and today we're taking a look at the Galaxy Buds 2 Pro. Uh, from a spec perspective, we can see that there has been some changes and there's also been some improvements. Uh, first of all, we'll talk about battery life, and battery life is measured in two ways, active noise canceling on and active noise canceling off. From an off perspective, you're gonna get fantastic battery life. You're talking about eight hours of battery life, and then with the case, you're gonna get 29 hours. Now, if you turn on active noise canceling on, there's a steep drop. You go up to five hours, but five hours is still long enough for a commute, a plane ride, um, you know, just the normal things that you would do, even a workout. So five hours with active noise canceling on, and also the case usage also drops down to 18 hours. Now, if you do happen to run out of power, the cool thing is that with a 10 minute charge, you're gonna get four hours of battery life. Now, one of the things I love about the Buds line is transparency mode and the ability to be able to hear very clearly around you. So these have transparency mode. They also have 360 audio and 20 fit, uh, 24 bit um, high definition audio, which we're going to try to simulate as best as we can in this video. Uh, they have 10 millimeter drivers, uh, the woofers, and then you have 5.3 millimeter tweeters, right? That's gonna give you again, accentuate the lows and also the highs, and you're gonna hear that in our audio test. The case also features Qi charging. It has an IPX rating of seven that's gonna give you, again, that ability to use them in the gym too, so you don't have to worry about them getting wet. Now in the box, you're gonna find your Samsung Galaxy Buds 2, and you'll notice that they're in a familiar case. The two pros look just like um, some of the predecessors. You also are gonna get a charging cable, and then you're gonna have some earbud tips. Now, the tips themselves are kind of hidden inside of the actual cable. So if you haven't seen them when you open up the case, make sure you dig in right here because they're gonna be there. Now the buds have gone through some changes. So still looking at the case, what you'll find is that you have that magnetic lock, which I really like. Uh, the earbuds guide themselves in really nicely, uh, but they have gotten much smaller. So you have left and right indicators, as you can see here, but they are tiny. Uh, you can see the charging points, you can see the sensors that are there, they do um, auto detect. You can use these independently, so you don't have to use them both um, in your ear at the same time. But let me show you how small these things are. So they've gotten super small. They're, they almost disappear in your ears. Now I'm gonna turn to the right, and I'm gonna turn to the left so you can see what they look like. And I'd say for most part, you know, and I have every version of the Samsung Galaxy Buds. And if you have been using them for quite some time, here's one thing I'll highlight. I have never had to use a tip to keep an earbud in because they fit just right. These though, I think I'm gonna to have to get a larger tip because they're so small. Now, you'll notice that they're very tapered, so they disappear again um, in your ears. Uh, very, very comfortable to wear and extremely lightweight. Now, what about the audio? What about the bass in the mids? Uh, bass is present, um, also treble is there. You know, high mids and low, good music separation. Uh, also, active noise canceling is great. And the cool thing about these is that when you start to speak, if you have active noise, noise canceling on, it basically turns them off. So the app, there's a setting in there where you can basically, uh, as soon as it detects a voice or speech, it will turn off. And then as soon as you stop speaking, within a couple seconds, it turns on active noise canceling again, which is a great deal. So great depth, great mids, highs, you have an immersive experience. The active noise canceling does a great job and it's just good all the way around. You look at me like I'm crazy When I shut my feelings out You look at me like I'm different Still you stay cause you feel something real Get so lost in my moments Doesn't mean I don't need you Now next we're going to do a call quality test of the Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro in a quiet environment. If you take a look at our decibel readings, 
anywhere between 26 and 27 decibels of noise. It's going to switch. Now, these are the Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro sound like in a quiet environment. This is a test. One, two, three. This is our test. Next, let's add some wind to the environment. Now, this is the Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro sound like with wind in the environment. This is a test. One, two, three. This is our test. Now we're adding some noise to the environment. As you can see here, our decibel readings are anywhere between 40 all the way up to almost 75, 77 decibels of noise. What we're going to do is we're going to switch. We're going to stay quiet to see how much noise is being canceled, and then we'll continue with the audio test. Let's go ahead and switch. Now this is the Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro sound like in a noisy environment. This is a test, one, two, three, this is our test. Now, if you're wondering what the Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro would sound like with an infant crying in the background, this is what they're gonna sound like with an infant crying in the background. Now, if you're wondering what they sound like with a dog barking in the background, this is what they sound like with a dog barking in the background. If you're curious about what they sound like with a doorbell ringing, this is what they're gonna sound like if the doorbell was ringing. So guys, that wraps up our review. See you in the next video.